we're back fsd hey we're going to be going for a perfect run here 10 out of 10 for driver confident that's my goal for today we're actually headed out to some dim sum here in markham just north of toronto it's a saturday morning with some average traffic not empty but not really bumper to bumper as well what i'm going to be simulating today is a normal suburban morning run not doing a, a huge stress test I want to give you an idea of what full self-driving is on some standard weekend situations. I haven't had too many 10 minute plus drives without any interventions, but I'm totally feeling really good about FSD today. We're going to be doing a couple of turns, some right turns, uh, double lane shifts, some left turns. Let's get going. Oh, I like this right now. Nice lane switch there. I love it when it does that well in advance of a future turn. You know, if you really want to grow FSD adoption over the years and you really want things to pick up, it's simple behaviors like that I think will make the difference. Nice human behavior in that it does the lane switch well in advance. Let's see how it takes this right turn. I'm going to be turning onto uh, a major road here right now. Easing into it. As you can see, it's a nice sunny day truck here on the left we'll see if it slows down and peeks out over that truck calmly moves forward yep Up, moving forward for visibility good yep some cars can be coming nope did a great job though yep nice assertive right turn there it did a fantastic job so what we're going to be doing is we're going to just speed things up here and uh, go down this avenue and we'll pick things up when we get into uh, the left lane switches and then a left turn. So far it's driven impeccably, very calm as you can see. It's uh, done a great job here. And uh, oh, I love this, how it's uh, it's gonna be going into the left lane right now, which is fantastic. So our left turn's gonna be coming up. There's uh, a double left turn lanes coming up. Let's see which lane it actually picks. It can go over one or two lanes. There's one. All right, cars are already moving, turning left. Let's see if it moves. Yep, it's moving into the left turn lane, the far left turn lane there. I like that. And we're going to be getting a red light right now, so it's going to stop. But uh, I really, really liked how it did that right there. Very assertive. It's good. It's at the front. These are all things that I would have normally done. I'm okay that it goes into the far left turn, even though we're going to be turning right at our destination. It's still it's still quite a bit away, so there's going to be more than enough time for FSD to move into the right lane before that. Great left turn there. And let's see how long it takes before it moves over into the right lane. And here we are comfortably moving into the right right lane well in advance of when we have to go turn right as you can see there on the map on my screen it's doing a fantastic job it was nice and smooth i really really like that i really like that i've seen fsd before when it was doing some you know lay, uh, later lane changes kind of cutting a little too close and uh, this is a uh, highly preferred the way it's been managing that so fantastic job fantastic job as you can see, this was just a nice leisurely drive. No surprises, great move into the right lane. I think overall, fantastic job. You know, we're coming to the end of job here on this uh, drive. Uh, this is our first perfect drive with FSD, so that's fantastic. It was able to handle those turns in traffic. It may have been a leisurely weekend drive, but it handled it 10 out of 10. I think it was a great drive that really showed FSD's capabilities. 
I want to thank you for watching today. If you're looking for weekly Tesla FSD content, then I'm here for you. Please sub subscribe so you don't miss any new FSD content. Safe driving to you all, and I'll see you on the roads.